Florida's a key battleground in the clash over what reading material is appropriate for our kids. Governor DeSantis signed three laws aimed at restricting reading or educational materials. Duval County Public School District restricted access to more than a million titles, keeping them out of students' hands until they were vetted by specialists. New this morning, the American Library Association named the memoir Gender Queer as its most challenged book of 2022. It is the second year in a row the book earned that title. It is a graphic memoir written and illustrated by Maya Kababi, recounting the author's journey from adolescence to adulthood. Other books that made the list include All Boys Aren't Blue, The Bluest Eye, Flamer, Looking for Alaska, The Perks of Being a Wallflower, Lawn Boy, The Absolutely True Diary of a Part-Time Indian, Out of Darkness, A Court of Mist and Fury, Crank, Me and Earl and the Dying Girl, and This Book is Gay. The ALA says attempted book bans and restrictions at schools and public libraries set a record last year. More than 1,200 challenges were compiled by the library group in 2022. That's nearly double the then record total from 2021 and by far the most since the ALA started keeping data 20 years ago. In total, 2,571 unique titles have been challenged since the group started recording the information. Now, Florida ranks second behind Texas as the state was the highest number of book removals, according to a report from Penn America.